Okay, so Memorial Day weekend, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sous vide up a lot of chicken breast. We've got this uh, weekend planned. We've got two couples with kids coming to hang out and uh, we're gonna have chicken tonight and then we'll have chicken that we can snack on for the entire weekend. What I've got here from America's Choice Gourmet is all natural mesquite flavor and all natural Italian. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's take them in the sous vide, 146 degrees for about an hour and a half. Take them out, sear them on the grill. Then we'll probably make some type of kebab or something like that for tonight and see what else we can mix up this weekend. Okay, so you can see this mesquite flavored and I'm telling you, you've got to sous vide these things because they are so moist. And then we have our Italian. Look at that seasoning. It's very nice. So these are good little flays, but they're not big, they're small. So and you can see I've got quite a few, but uh, that should be enough to keep us satisfied for the weekend and hey, maybe even the next week. Okay, you can see we're now at 145. We're almost at 146. I'm gonna let this chicken just soak, soak in that heat. I'm gonna cook that chicken to perfect tenderness. And then we're gonna take it out seared on the grill. Okay, so for the first course tonight on our Friday night of Memorial Day weekend is a nice mix that my wife has worked out. Normally this would be for the skewer. We're not gonna skewer it though. It's smoked sausage, pineapple, and some teriyaki, all sauteed. We're gonna take this and throw it on our smoking hot grill and that's course number one okay so the sugar in the teriyaki the sugar in the pineapple and starting to solidify this is becoming a beautiful dish you can see it is looking like and lena my chef in training, mm -hmm. she is making it happen. Hey, George, does this smell good? Yeah. Do you think you're gonna like to taste it? Maybe. <laughs> okay, so here's the second course, and this will go with the chicken. We got zucchini all seasoned up with some Italian seasonings, some corn on the cob, some tomatoes. We're gonna throw this on the grill, soften everything up. Not to the point to where it's mushy, but uh, yeah. So now we're cooking this zucchini salad over the grill and the Italian seasoning smell incredible. I wish you could smell this, but the reality is this is gonna end up getting put over arugula and that's what makes it a zucchini salad. Then we've got a couple layers of corn. Looking good. Zucchini looks perfect, smells incredible. The tomatoes are adding a lot of color. And we've got the corn, because you know the corn takes just a little bit longer. And I'm gonna tell you now, I can already smell the sugar that's cooking out of the corn. But uh, yeah, it's getting perfect. So we're getting ready to take this off the grill. This is gonna go inside and cool down and get ready to go on its bed of arugula. And that's gonna make the salad. So then, it's gonna be time to get that chicken get it on the grill. Okay, so uh, we've done with the vegetables. Now I've put a little oil on the grill. I've scraped it down, get all the seasoning off, and we're gonna season this thing up and get it nice and oiled up and ready for the chicken. Look at that chicken. Big old bowl of breast. We got Italian and mesquite flavored. Oh, that's good living. Okay, so we now have our at 164 degrees, excuse me, 146 degrees for about two hours, uh, which means you could eat this chicken and still be healthy, but we're gonna sear it. We have our mesquite flavored and Italian flavored uh, from America's Choice Gourmet. Thanks, John. Uh, it's gonna be a great Memorial Day weekend. 
Okay, so you can see we have our uh, zucchini, arugula, corn salad. We got our chicken grilled, sous vide, and grilled perfectly. I've got a little piece of the Italian here, and I'm gonna tell you now, it is so moist, it is so perfect. John, America's Choice Gourmet, thank you so much. I have not been able to beat the chicken I get from there. But anyway, uh, also the perfect way to do this is, is 146 degrees sous vide for an hour and a half to two hours. Sear it on the grill, get that nice grilled finish. Mm. It's perfect. We have so much chicken. Uh, it's gonna be a great weekend. Happy Memorial Day and good luck. Also, look forward to more videos from this weekend. Probably gonna do some burgers, some other things. Uh, of course, I don't know, this might be enough chicken to keep us through the weekend. We'll see.